Kala, Yahweh Bashim, Yahweh Shah, Yahweh Bashim, Yahweh Shah, Bashim, Wahar, Kadash, double honors to the elder apostles of Great Millstone who rule well, who taught us this truth, all right? The elders and apostles out of New York. Um, Shalom and salutation to the hopeful elect, the Akim out there presenting their bodies as a living sacrifice, as the scriptures do say. Shalom to the few sisters that do listen to us as well. All right, this is uh, a message, basically, um, you know, for brothers in the body. And um, I'm going to get right into it, man. You know, just, 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 uh, just more of a, a message, a reality check, a life check, you know, because we get on Esau, we get on the heathens. All right, and that great millstone, hey, we, we get on each other too, man. All right, and um, I'm going to just bring this out, man. I'm going to start with this uh, Corinthians. This is uh, first, first Corinthians 9 and, and 25. And every man that striveth for the mastery t is temperate in all things. Now they do it for, now they do it to obtain a corruptible crown, but we for an incorruptible I therefore so run, not as uncertainty, not as uncertainty, so I fight, not as one that beateth the air. So he's saying he's doing this thing for a purpose. The biggest purpose that we in this truth, man, is to ultimately get salvation, man, and find favor with Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shai, and make it up out of this place. All right? This truth is not a, um, a, a, a fucking a, a, a game, man. It's not a game. It's not a pastime. It's not a fucking frat house. This is the body of Yahweh Shah. This is the body of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shah. This is the church. All right. So it's a certain way we must conduct ourselves. All right. Verse on 26. I therefore run not as uncertainty. So I fight not as one that beateth the air. But I keep under my but I keep under my body and bring it into subjection, lest by any means when I have preached to others, I myself shall be should become a castaway. Look, he said, but I, verse 27 again, but I keep under my body and bring it into subjection, lest by any means when I have preached to others, I myself should be a castaway. Exactly. Because we, we discipline ourselves, man. Whether it comes to our conduct, you know, walking, to how we walk toward those that are without the body, you know, how we look amongst the two thirds in the world, all right, how we discipline ourselves on the line. All right, and that's another big thing, man. And I wanted to get into that too. Conduct on the line, man. When you when you out there, know you out there set for the defense of the gospel. We here to usher in the kingdom of heaven. We here to preach the laws, statutes, and commandments. See how about Shimmy, how shy? We here to Isaiah fifty eight and one. We here to cry aloud, spare not. But it's the way we do it. That's how we the why we have an order system. We have a ranking system. All right, and certain brothers, man. And you got to work within the bounds of your ranking system, man. If a brother older than you tell you to do something, you better fucking do it, man. And if that brother going off, hey, when that, that's between him and the Lord. But other than that, man, you follow the course, how, how it was set, man. All right? We, don't, we, we ain't out there to put on a fucking show. All right? And we ain't taking our emotions to work neither. The fucking dog died. When you get on the line, so what? All right, you might get fired from your job. When you get on a fucking line, so what? The nigga woman might have left you. When you get on a fucking line, so what? So fucking what? You let the Lord deal with that, man. The scriptures say casting all your cares upon him. And I, me and other brothers have been through it all, man. He said the, the same things uh, in the book of Peter. I, 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 uh, I'm roughly quoting it. I experienced by your brothers in the world, man. We all going through the same fucking shit, man. But when you get on that line, brothers, man, you brothers hold your post, man. We like the Spartans, man. We ain't breaking no fucking rank, man. This is warfare, man. Especially when you're dealing with the two-thirds, when you're dealing with law enforcement. And half of the time, especially when these trick-ass jakes, so I'm speaking about here in Chicago, they done called the law on us and shit. The law be on our side. Even if we go upside their goddamn head, man. You know, we, 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 I mean, we don't aspire to do that, but hey, Jake, Jake a motherfucker out here. But hey, man, the law know us, man. We've been out here all these years, man. They all, there's some crazy niggas in the road, man. Hey, get, get, get out of here, man. Hey, y'all brothers, uh, you know, they always give us the fake little fist. But you know, you agree with your adversary quickly, man. You don't provoke the law, man. You don't provoke these niggas. You don't taunt them, man. All we do is read the scriptures, man. When the Most High give us the power to put a foot in their ass, 
That's when you do it. But to the end, hey, we subject, man, to rulers, man. But that all ties in to that scripture, man, when he said, when he talked about disciplining yourself and bring our body into subjection, man. When you a man of the Lord, man, hey, the apostle Paul, the apostle Paul said, um, all things are lawful, but not all things are expedient. You know, he went to all things being lawful, but not all things edify not, man. You know, it's a lot of things we can do within the bounds of the law. You know, as far as like even certain little situations like a, a woman we may deal with or something like that. But it ain't expedient. Just like to fuck all these hoes. I have three or four hoes. That's lawful. But it ain't expedient. Especially if you're a true man and you have a shy, and you're doing this work because that requires time. We discipline our bodies, man. We, we cut off a lot of that shit, man. You know, we shut our mouth when we supposed to. That come to discipline your bodies, man. You know, and things like that. So, you know, the conduct in the world, man, and, and, and your conduct on the line, man, it's just, um, you know, this just was on my spirit, man, to, to bring this stuff out, man, because Jake, you know, they learn a couple scriptures, man, but they don't learn. It's a balance within the scriptures. The scriptures come with discipline, man. This truth comes with discipline. This is uh, Ephesians 5 and um, 5. It says, see then that ye will, I'm going to start at 14. It said, um, Ephesians 5 and 14, wherefore he saith, awake thou that sleepest, arise from the dead, and Mashiach, Yahweh Shai, shall give thee light. And that's what he gave us when he gave us the truth. He gave us a gift, man. All right, he gave us the light. See then that ye walk circumspectly, not as fools, but as wise, redeeming the time, because the days are evil. And that's what we do. We redeem the times, all right, because these days are evil, all right? The, the, these people out here are fucked up, all right? The so-called white man is the devil. But when we, when we on the line, all right, and we going out there to teach, we work within the bounds of the struct of the scriptures and the order system that was set up. All right. And we follow that tooth and nail, so to speak. This is a uh, Sirach uh, 27 and 12. It said, if thou be amongst the indiscreet, observe the time and continually be among men of understanding. And when we go out to the highways and the byways, we are amongst the indiscreet. When we go to our job, we are amongst the indiscreet. All right. We amongst the industry and it's a certain way you operate amongst the industry. You that's that's when the wisdom come in. The knowledge of you being an Israelite, the knowledge of you knowing a white man, the devil. That's the knowledge that the most high gave you. But he gave you a wisdom factor as, as well as that to, 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 to exercise this knowledge, to put all the pieces in the right place, so to speak, when you when you amongst the industry, man. When you out there in the highways and the byways, when you out there in the hedges, all right? That's why the Lord, um, even in the law, he talked about keeping the law, um, having, a mission, having them as portlets, so to speak, man. Because, you know, I don't want to sound like I'm ratting or nothing, but brothers got to operate with wisdom, man. And brothers got to be in the spirit of Yahweh Bashir and Yahweh Shai, man. And brothers got to exercise balance in this truth, man. This this not a fucking game, man. These doubles are finding any reason to shoot a nigga. All right? These doubles are finding any reason, you know, to stop this ministry. You do not want to endanger the body, man, when we out there on the highways and the byways, man. By, by, by bucking up against some two-thirds. All right? By bucking up against some cops. I mean, that, 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 that you know, that rah-rah shit, man, you know. It, 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 scripture said as, as much as possible Be at peace with all men If it be possible Be at peace with all men Alright and, and brothers gotta learn How to exercise that Whether it's the way you, you act With your conduct on the line Whether it's you holding your peace From um, something you might Your flesh might want to do That actually might be May Be, be, be semi lawful Alright <laughs> it ain't no such thing as either it's on or it's off. But but something that's not expedient, man, you know, you want to keep that away from the body, man, especially if it reflects on the body. All right. I hope I'm coming across clear. Try to find this other scripture. 
Tom, this is a uh, Colossians. This is what I was looking for. This is a uh, Colossians four, and there are four. It says that thou may make it manifest as I ought to speak. Walk in wisdom toward them that are without, redeeming the times. And that's what we do, man. Walk with wisdom toward them that are without, redeeming the times. It says let your speech always be with grace, seasoned with salt, that ye may uh, uh, that ye may know. That ye may know how ye ought to answer every man, you know, and that's what we do, especially like when we're dealing amongst the elements, when we're dealing with the cops, you know, we speak with grace, man. The scriptures say, Be wise as a serpent, not harmless as a dove. You know, the scriptures say, Agree with thy adversary quickly. All right, we walk in wisdom toward them that are without, redeeming the time, especially when we on the line, but amongst our daily life, you know, this, this is not going to be a long video, matter of fact. Um, let me see. I don't want to talk too much, man. I just want to get a quick point across. You know, brothers, be wise, man. And, you know, have, have discipline. All right. This is Yahweh Shai. This is uh, St. Matthew 10 and 16. It says, Behold, I send you forth as sheep in the midst of wolves. Be ye therefore wise as serpents and harmless as doves. So, hey, man, we don't want to do nothing to endanger the body. We want to be wise as the serpent. The serpent is, is the wise creature, man. But we want to be harmless as doves as well. We want to exercise the wisdom that Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai gave us in our daily lives when it comes to disciplining ourselves. When we out there defending the gospel on the highways and the byways, we ain't no niggas in this truth, man. The Most High didn't give you this truth to be a nigga, man. You want to work in the bounds of the scriptures, like the elder Uriah always say. And you want to have discipline, man, and you want to exercise that wisdom, man, and get that experience, all right? But with that being said, I hope this was edifying to you, brothers in the body. All praise, honor, and glory due to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh, Shah. Double honors to the elder apostles of great millstone and to the hopeful elect. I say shalom.